everybody. Everyone's alone. Yeah, exactly. What's up, Steve? Nice to meet you. Steve. This is enormous for these young men to take their moment in the in the sun and, and their experience as a wildcat to bring awareness to the cystic fibrosis foundation and the work that we're doing to combat CF is, uh, I, I, I can't even tell you how big it is. I work all day, all year, and I can't bring the kind of awareness that they can with, with this event. Uh, the Wildcats are the biggest show in town. Every Tucson loves Arizona, and for I'm humbled that, that these young men take this opportunity to, to help us. Give me 12, give me 12, one more, one more. You got more? Ah! Woo! How about that? Good, last two of them. Oh! Woo! Yeah. All you, one more! One more! One, ah! two, one! Yeah. Come on. So they throw on 15, they get to here, and they move all the way around here. We do, we can do biceps, triceps, abs, go ahead and try one. All right, now you're gonna use all your abs here, so turn as fast as you can. There you go, good, good, good. Uplifting Athletes is an organization that uh, helps uh, uh, people, kids with uh, rare disease. So um, uh, Uplifting Athletes partners with uh, universities like University of Arizona, uh, the only school in the Pac-12 that has an uplifting athletes chapter and helps uh, kids and, and people with rare diseases and rare, rare causes. You know, uh, one of the big things is just that uh, being able to have the support and so uh, one thing uh, uplifting athletes does that allows a lot of support and a lot of awareness uh, for these rare diseases um, across the country. So being able to touch base and connect with uh, college athletes and things like that definitely helps bring awareness and more uh, research for different rare disease causes. Josh, give us a brief rundown of uplifting athletes and, and our connection to Ames and all that. It, uh, it started on the East Coast and then they moved towards the West Coast and they need a, a school to represent the West Coast and we were the first school that, that uh, was blessed enough to, to be able to represent the West Coast and um, they came to us and we, we got to pick the disease and um, from uh, prior trips to the Children's Hospital here in Tucson we knew Andrew with, with CF and we knew right away he's the kid we wanted to sponsor. It's been, it's been awesome that he's a Wildcat fan and everything. We, we've had him out to one of the games. I believe it was like the Oregon game, which was an awesome experience for him because that was the upset. And uh, it, it's just awesome having him in town because we can see him when he's in the hospital. We can go visit him, try to keep his spirits up. And then he's also a motivation for us. Um, I think Andrew being a part of it is great for him. Um, he's a huge Wildcat fan, you know, loves the team. Um, he has a great chance to meet all the players. On um, the lift, you know, I mean, it's just a great way for everyone to get um, motivated, get excited for the lift. Um, great way to raise money for Andrew and cystic fibrosis. Um, at, the, at first, it, it was hard to get uh, jump started, but um, after a while, I mean, everyone, we got other players on the team tweeting about it, Instagramming about it, um, trying to raise money for their teams, uh, making a competition. There's really no words how to express how I feel. It's just so amazing to be a part of Arizona football. I mean, I've watched them a lot, and to be here, it's just like, it's like, it's a dream, basically. And it's, it's something I'll never forget. And I like it a lot.